So the Templars Commandery is just there, behind the houses there. And this is a Templars Chapel here. De la Grasse. And this is where they killed the, the last dragon of France by uh, Saint Georges. Yeah. Saint George. So the guy who, uh, it was the, uh, the knight Lagardelle qui a tué, uh, who killed the, uh, the last uh, dragon of France. So here's the entrance of the Templars Chapel. And here you see, this is, you know, the Templars V. And this is what they found, you know, where they entered the big pyramid. Uh, you can still see it where the entrance is. Uh, where they found the Templars treasure of their ancestors, uh, which they didn't uh, give a part to the French king, so he was double angry because of that. And so this means you're, and here, I don't know what this is, well, it looks very phallic, you know, with, oh, horrible. The Templar homos, they must have liked that, right? So that means you enter the realm of Egypt, if you go in here with this here. You're entering the realm, like it's like the uh, Citroën the car here. You know? Everything has a function. It's beautiful here. Look at that. Wow. They're always in these remote areas, you know. Not a little door. Hello, somebody here. Oh, it's open. Oh, that's good. Huh. Let's ring the bell. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> oh, not much to see. The sun here, yeah. There's the Templars Cross. There you go. So here you can see the sun here, everywhere. How many times? Eight times. Octagon, yeah. So here you see the Seal of Solomon. It's also the concept of four with the four blue lines around there. So that's nothing to do with the Jews. It's the uh, King Solomon of the Jews. The M sign everywhere from Mason. They say it's Maria. But with all the pharaonic colors. Red for where they come from, the old world's order. White for Mason in the middle, and it was a war, blue around it. So through a war, they got to rule. So that's a real Templish chapel, eh? It's, it's everywhere, there's so many. It's all, always a remote place somewhere. Whereas uh, here it's in the well, pretty much south, south middle. Always very simple little chapels like this. Templars. I don't see much Templar symbols. Oh. So this is a, uh, this is not Templars. And it's uh, for the uh, pilgrims, for the eyes. And this is where the dragon uh, used to hide, apparently. Uh, mm. Somewhere in there. Hello, dragon! <laughs> so he can cure your eyes, apparently. Oi! Hello, Swissy. You're here too? Of course you are, eh? Now look all these little cabins here. So look, here you can see that symbol, that's Isis, with the little boy doing a Freemason uh, sign here, look at that, again. Yeah, there you go. Oh, that's Horus, of course, and Isis, the, the, the queen, and the dragon here, it's Seth. So here you see I, H, S, Isis, Horus, and Seth. And this dragon is the same dragon as in um, the lake of uh, Loch Ness. Uh, which is, of course, uh, the, the devil coming from another realm, 
as uh, the Bol Skyn house of Alistair Crowley. It's, it happens to be just at the border of the... Uh, uh, just looking uh, down at the, uh, at, at the, uh, the lake of Loch Ness. Yeah. So, yeah, look at this altar here. Oh. That's a common altar, huh? Oh, no. So this Horus matrix, it's the same thing as the big cross here. And this is a, uh, for a sacrifice, the table. And the sacrifice is here. Because the symbol of, the symbol of Jesus on a cross is mankind, man on a cross. You, you can't move your hand. You're not allowed to defend yourself. Uh, you can just move your head and say, no, darling, yes, darling, or yes, Mr. President, no, Mr. Judge, and never do it again. So this here, the cross on the floor, is the same as this here. It's all the Horus Matrix. The whole bloody thing is the Horus Matrix. Oh, look, so oh, slept here. And as you can see, all the fallen down trees there. Now I'm a bit afraid to sleep in the, uh, in the forest. There too, all the logs there. Look, this one is quite dead. Oh, I, got it, I, I would have got it on my head, you know, if it would have fallen down. So I had no other choice. I walked through the forest for two hours, maybe. And I was tired. I just thought, I want to crash. The only place I could find is where the, you know, where the farm he just, the shit had hit the fan here. Just probably the same day. You know, the proverbial shit hits the fan. Well, the fan of the, uh, the thing behind the tractor, you know, it's, it's, Oh, I'd be glad to have some fresh hair over there after this night. Or smell some McDonald's or kebab. <laughs> you know. yeah. It was freezing here last night. It's called Massif Central. Damn. Oh, minus five in the night. Or... Yeah. Well, let's go on. 